hello hello everyone welcome 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 how is everyone doing i hope everyone's having a great night or day depending what time it is for you happy sunday if it's still saturday for you then happy saturday i hope everyone's having a great weekend fun relaxing and safe weekend tonight we're back with more um more chilling rain uh pack openings this time tonight we are opening a uh, booster box so a lot more a lot more packs to open tonight and just packs unlike um, last night where we opened uh, two chilling rain uh, elite trainer boxes where you know I came with the typical you know elite trainer box stuff you know sleeves uh, energy cards those I guess damage indicator coins the dice the dividers and of course the packs so yeah, so this time we're just opening packs, and, um, and hopefully the the luck that we got from last night hopefully it continues tonight. Um, I hope we get a lot of car, a lot of great cards. Um, so I did after I ended stream last night. I know I said um, I didn't want to see, I didn't want to like spoil myself, and um, I want to go into the pack blind or pack opening blind last night and um and then i said i was gonna look at the set list after i ended stream so i did and there were a lot of cards a lot of cards in uh in the set list in this set list that i kind of want to get um as you can see in the title of the stream there is like a couple named in there <clears throat> mainly i want to get um galarian zapdos v so we can you know complete the the, the bird trio I want to get the shadow rider but not spectral rider and I've been saying I've been saying glacial rider and spectral rider last night and I saw the uh, the booklet from the ETB and they're, it's called ice rider and shadow rider so yeah, yeah I know I looked probably sound dumb saying the wrong thing last night but yeah so I want to get shadow rider calyrex doesn't matter which one I guess I don't know maybe well I guess alternate art or the more rare the better but i just want to see i want to hopefully get shadow rider calyrex um v or v max I, I guess v max is more um preferable but whichever is fine for me i guess um there was a alternate art rap uh, glaring rapidash v that i saw that looks so cool and looks so pretty so I want to see if we can pull that. Um, there's a Blissey. There's a Blissey card that I want to get, um, or at least hopefully we'll get. Uh, what else? So there are there are actually three shiny like uh, like actual three shiny Pokemon cards uh, or Pokemon yeah Pokemon cards in this set. Um, it's Electrode, Bron, Bronzong. Right? I think Bronzong and um, Snorlax. I want to get Snorlax, either Snor or mainly Snorlax, but uh, I also want to get Electrode as well. So either of those. Um, so I think that's it. I don't think I really want to get any of the full art trainer cards, really. But if we get them, cool. But, but of course, whatever cards we get, whatever like full art cards, whatever V, V Max or Rainbow or Gold Rare cards we get tonight is awesome, but you know those specific ones I just named, um, yeah, I do want to get tonight. So hopefully we hopefully we'll get them. So yeah, let's uh, open this up. Oops, and see. And hopefully our luck, um, you know, hopefully our luck from last night continues on tonight. Yeah. Got my knife here. Alright. Okay. 
So I wonder, I wonder if we'll get like more rare cards this time around. Because of course the last time we did a, a booster box was, you know, a couple nights ago where we did a, a battle styles booster box. And we got quite a bit of uh, like full art cards in that box. So let's see if we can, you know, top, top the amount tonight. Also, I got a. Also, got an, or already know that I'm gonna count how many packs are in there because you can't, you know, be too sure if you know. Can't be too sure or too careful, whatever the term is. So I'm gonna put that back there. Have that stand. Here we go. All right, so we're gonna count. Make sure we have 36 packs because yeah okay one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve fifteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen okay that's eighteen on this side Take these out. Bug Dad, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Welcome to the crew. How are you doing tonight? Welcome to the stream. Let's see, there's 18 on this side. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen. Okay, cool. So we got our thirty-six packs. I know, I know it's kind of odd for me to count them, but I mean nowadays, like I said, you can't be too careful, especially even though from where you buy it from. You just can't be too careful, right? So yeah, here are here's the booster box from the top, and then front view, side view. I guess you want to see the back. Nothing special in the back, but yeah, so we're gonna be opening these. And um, also, so I'm gonna, this this is gonna be on the side because you know to be out of the way. But I know it's gonna be off frame, but you can kind of see it right there. But yeah, it's gonna be right there, so it's gonna be out of the way, and I can have room to um, place cards on the on the mat, so you guys can see what I get. But um, another reminder that uh, I don't play the online card game, so I do give out the uh, card code from each pack, because um, yeah, I, I mean I rather give it to um, you guys who or. Um, yeah, I'd rather give it to you guys that play it than just, you know, not use them, I guess. But, yeah. Um, let's get started, right? Alright, so we're gonna do what the same the same way we did with the, uh, the Battle Styles booster box and, um, just randomly pull from, you know, just randomly pull from the box and we'll go from there. Okay, so we pull it randomly from the left side. So we got first the Moltres artwork. Appreciate you giving the codes, man. Yeah, no worries. But of course, it's a first come, first serve sort of thing, you know, since I show it on stream. And um, yeah. So whoever redeems it first gets the code. So yeah, it is the first serve, first come, first serve, sorry, sort of thing. So. Good luck to whoever, or to all who play it and uh, gets the code, stuff like that. All right, how are you doing, Bug? Uh, how are you doing, Bug Dad? Welcome to the stream once again. Thank you also for the follow earlier. I hope you're having a a great weekend and a great night or day. Come on now.
Okay. Here's the first code card for you guys. Pause the stream, take a screenshot, do what you have to to get the code. But of course I'm not going to be holding up the code for, you know, for too long on screen. Because I want to get through, of course we got like a whole 36 packs of cards to get through. So yeah, I want to make sure we get through all of them tonight. Yeah. So we got Grass Energy. Let's see if I can put it there so you guys can see. Uh, been a good Sunday morning so far. How about you? I've been, I've been well. We just started, as you can see. Um, but my weekend, it's been all right. Um, it's been fun so far. I mean, pack uh, opening Chilling Rain uh, packs wise. Uh, last night. We did a stream on uh, opening two Chilling Rain ETBs, and we got three uh, V cards, uh, four regular uh, Hollow cards. So hopefully we'll continue the luck tonight and uh, get uh, you know some more better cards. All right, we got Spiral Energy, Rapid Strike. So we didn't get this before. That's an Energy Honey. We didn't get that either last night. I don't think. Alright, Avery. For Brawler. No run. Weedle. Cast form. Quillfish. Reverse Hollow Surviper. And our rare for this pack is. Wall Rain. Non, non hollow, sadly. But it's a card that we don't have, so I'm happy about that. Um, I know that's going to be off screen, so I think I'll put it up here. Yeah, up here. Maybe lower it a bit. Because we are going to put like whatever like full art cards lean against the keyboard. Because, I mean, you know more space I guess but yeah, I'll put the whatever rare card we get up here or non rare or non hollow rare up here all right so let's uh, pull from the right side so we got Galarian Zapdos artwork here Do you collect any of the uh do you collect Pokemon cards, Bug Dad, or do you just play the uh online game? Okay, code card for you guys. Do only play the online game. Gotcha, gotcha. You don't play uh, the the uh, main Pokemon games, or do you just only play the card game? Okay, we got Dark Energy, Kuna. Karen, uh, Karen's Conviction, Echoing Horn, Deli Bird, Galarian Farfetch, Oregon, Coughing, Weedle, Reverse Hollow Impact Energy. That's fancy. Only play the card game. Ah, I got you, I got you. Nothing wrong with that. And our rare is Kecleon. Non hollow. Rapid Strike Kecleon there. Alright. 
Let's pull another one from the right side here. Ugh, excuse me. More press. So far, I guess our luck hasn't really moved from last night since or at least we did better like in the beginning parts of uh the battle styles booster box we did the other night like we started the the pack openings with a a full art pull from the first the very first pack we got or we opened from the booster box but this time around yeah our luck isn't so good so far Hopefully it'll get better. Okay. Co card. And if you're wondering why I'm covering the QR code on the co card, it's because I know not a lot of people, you know, have access to the you know QR a QR scanner, so I guess I'm being fair somewhat. All right, fighting energy. There is Drizzile, Dynatree Hill, Justify Gloves, Shop It. Up foo Little Oilfish Valerian Slowpoke Fire Resistance Gloves is our reverse hollow. And our rare for this pack is Sorora V. Yeah, look at that. Zara Aura, sorry, I'm, I read, I said that wrong. Zara Aura V. Yo, that looks awesome. That looks really cool. First full art is a legendary or mythic, right? I guess mythics. Yeah, mythics are the are are the ones that gets distributed and not like found in game legendaries are the ones that are obtained in game i believe so that's awesome again not a card that i want but a card that i'll i'll accept because or i mean honestly any v card we get in, in any set is accepted you know so we're gonna put that there our very first v full art card that's awesome let's pull from the left side of the box here another zapdos artwork it's freaking amazing still still hoping for um Galarian Zapdos, so we can complete the uh, the bird trio, because we did pull Articuno and Moltres last night in one of the, um, in, or in both the ETBs that we opened last night. So hopefully we'll get it. Hopefully we'll get it. All right, co card for you guys. Again, first come, first serve, so good luck. <laughs> okay. Fire energy. Welcoming lantern. Reboot. Agatha. Honestly, like opening these uh, these card packs recently makes me want to replay uh, Sword again. 
So maybe I'll, I don't know, maybe I'll do another playthrough of Sword. Shop it at some point, or I don't know. Or just wait for uh, Gen 4 remakes to release. I don't know. Uh, Cub Fu? Rapid Strike Blitzel. Quillfish. Galarian Slowpoke. Reverse Hollow Justified Gloves. And our rare for this pack is... Hatterene! It's also a hollow Hatterene. Awesome, we don't have this one yet, so this is cool. That's awesome. Hold on. Put that in the sleeve as well. Again, I know using the like ETB sleeves aren't ideal, but again, I'm using what I have. Oh, you guys can see that. All right, we're gonna pull from the very front on the right side. Got Articuno artwork right there. Again, still hoping for Zapdos. I mean, if we if we also pull any of the like alternate artworks of the birds, that would be awesome too. But still, still want that Zapdos, right? Sorry, I'm trying to like not pull too hard on the cards because I don't want to damage them. But I did that. I think I somewhat did that in uh. When I did the, uh, when I would open, when, I, when we were doing the, uh, Battle Styles booster box and I kind of damaged some of the cards. Thankfully, it was only, like, the common ones, the common cards, but, I mean, I guess I still damaged them regardless. There you go. Water energy. Rapid strike scroll of skies. Curlia. Ball crystal. Snover. Galarian yaw mask. Coughing. Up it. that oh look at that cute rock rough reverse hollows rock rough look at it playing in the snow that's so that's adorable okay and our rare is another wall rain interesting I mean I guess it's not this hasn't happened to happened to us before that we've gotten um Two of the same rares and you know in the same pack opening stream but I mean I guess it's more common since we have a we're doing a booster box opening all right let's pull from the very back on the left side okay we've got the ice rider calyrex artwork there Okay. There you go, co card.
Okay. Got electric energy. Steeny. Sorry, I'm trying to strain out the piles. Alright, Dynatree Hill. Spiral Energy. Deerling. Valerian Slowpoke. Coughing. Galarian Yaw Mask. Snow Run. Oh, our reverse rare this time. Reverse Hollow is Wall Rain. And our rare is another Metagross V. So, as you notice, we set, I said another Metagross V because we did pull a Metagross V last night in uh, the ETB opening, but hey. I'm sure, like I said, it's, it's more common to get uh, duplicates this time. But hey, Metagross V still looks cool. Awesome. Okay, still gonna put it in the sleeve though. Uh, our second V full art. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it in front of the Zera Aura because if I just made like kept continuing down, it's not gonna, you know, not enough room. Hey, okay. Zapdos. Two full arts so far and a regular regular hollow. Okay. There you go. And I also noticed that um I've also noticed that um Chilling Rain doesn't have an amazing rare. Um, if you guys don't know what an amazing rare is, um, it's those, it's those hollow cards that have like the hollow or the artwork actually popping out of the, um, art, the art border. Um, but yeah, this set doesn't have an amazing rare. Okay, yeah, hold on. I need to check something real quick here. Whoops. Okay, sorry. Just making sure of something real quick. All right, but I, I didn't do the, the thing. All right, but yeah, it's kind of kind of unfortunate this set doesn't have an amazing rare. I think that's what they're called. Okay, water energy. Yonia. Wait, is this a different artwork? I think this is a. I don't remember if this is the same artwork before. I don't know. I don't know if there's like alternate artworks of um, some trainer cards. Whirl Pete. Crushing Gloves. Deerling. Valerian Slowpoke. Coughing. 
Galeria Yamask. Snow Run. Ooh. Reverse Hollow Thunderous. That's nice. I like that. That artwork looks amazing. Especially with this like reverse hollow outer border or outer car shininess, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> but yeah, I think that looks nice. And our rare for this pack is Ooh, Valcarona. We don't have this. But that's awesome. That is really cool. Love the artwork. So we don't have that. That's awesome that we had uh, that we got it now. Okay. Do that. Left. All right. Shadow Rider Calyrex artwork there. Okay. Fighting energy. Sorry. Peonia. Fire resistant gloves. Crabomitable. Aaron. Snow run. Benepete, Snover, Valerian Slowpoke, Reverse Hollow Melanie, and the rare for this pack is another Cinderace. So we did pull uh, a hollow cinderace last night as well. That's cool. I mean, we got another one. I still think pretty cool though. Still put uh, put this in a sleeve. We we'll put all like hollow cards in the sleeve. Despite it, if we, you know, if we got it again or not. Or, yeah. If we get it again or not. Hatterene. Alright. Let's do another left side. Let's do this one. Okay, snap those. Okay. Got dark energy, impact energy. Ooh, Porygon two. Nice. We don't have this. It's a really pretty uh, Porygon two artwork. Got Thwacky, Diglett.
Golet. Deerling. Farfetched. Furfro. Another card that we don't have, actually. Reverse Hollow Curlia. And our rare for this pack is. Yo! Rainbow Rare Metagross V Max. Yo, this is my. What a way to get a second V Max card as a Rainbow Rare. Holy shit. My second ever V Max card. And it's a rainbow rare. That is insane. <laughs> that is awesome. Did the music stop? Sorry. I think the music did stop. Yeah. My bad. I'm playing music from YouTube, so it does pause occasionally because I'm not on, on the tab. But that is amazing. That is awesome. Hell yeah. So we got both regular Metacross V and now Metacross V Max. Hold on, let me do a side by side here. Look at that. Ho oh, ho. That is awesome. That is really, really awesome. I'm gonna put that right there. So V Maxes, of course, get their own, get their own pile. But if I get like a regular V Max card, um, that's gonna be a separate pile. And Rainbow Rares, I guess, get their own pile. Or if I, I mean, if, if that's if I get another Rainbow Rare, but you get what I mean. That's awesome, though. All right, so we got an Ice Rider artwork on this one. I pulled this from the right side in the box. Hope we can uh, continue the hype. Shit. I mean, we did. We also did pull a rainbow card in the Battle Styles booster box. Uh, if I remember correctly, I believe we pulled uh, a Cheryl, a trainer, a Rainbow uh, Rainbow Cheryl trainer card. I think that's her. Yeah, I think that's her name. But yeah, we did pull one Rainbow Rare in that box as well. All right. Uh, good card for you guys. There you go. Okay. That is awesome. That is awesome. I am very happy that uh, I was able to get another VMAX because, like I said, I only had one one other uh, VMAX card, and that's uh, Aegis Slash that I pulled from um, Vivid Volt a Vivid Voltage uh, Elite Trainer Box, so having a second one is uh, an amazing feeling, honestly. Okay, got water energy, Hatram, oops, almost put it in the wrong pile, Laffy, Bakuna, Golet, Lobopus, Snowy form, cast form. Atena. Aaron. Oh, another snowy form, cast form for our reverse hollow. And our rare for this pack is. Yo, Calor Shadow, blah, blah, blah. tongue tied. Sorry, 
Shadow Rider Calyrex V. We did it. We finally we got one of the cards that we wanted. Hell yeah. Shadow Rider Calyrex V. I'm pretty sure this is uh I don't know if this is the normal art. I don't remember if this is like the just a normal art or one of the alternative arts. But hey, I I I mean, like I said earlier, I don't think it really like for me. I don't think it doesn't matter which artwork I got, as long as we got what we, um, as long as I you know got what I want. So that's awesome. That's awesome. Got Shadow Rider. One, one like Pokemon cards. Hello. Or I'm assuming that one is supposed to be I like Pokemon cards, but I'm assuming I like Pokemon cards specifically got taken. But welcome to the stream. How are you? Gonna open any more packs? Yes, we are. We're still opening a, or we're opening a booster box, so we're still going right now. Um, I don't even think we're even halfway through yet, but, um, hey, we just got, we just pulled a, uh, Shadow Rider Calyrex V in our recent pack here, so that's freaking amazing. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Okay. Ah, speaking of Shadow Rider, <laughs> we're doing a Shadow Rider artwork on this booster pack here. But yeah. Sorry, no Zichi. But again, if anyone that plays the online card game, I do give out the, uh, the code cards, but it's like a first come first serve sort of thing. Because I don't play the, uh... I don't play the the online game. I don't play the physical card game either, but um, you know I just collect them. But I mean, I rather might as well give out the uh, the code card instead of just you know throwing them away and not having them redeemed. So might as well give them to someone that you know has actual use for them instead of just throwing them away, right? Okay. Sell them? Eh. I mean, I can do that. I can. But. It's fine. I'll just, you know, give them to whoever plays them. Whoever plays the game. So it's fine. Go Peas, welcome. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. How was your weekend? How was your night going? Welcome. We are doing a, uh. Pokemon cards opening stream tonight. We are specifically opening a opening a uh, Chilling Rain booster box. Uh, we're already a couple packs in, and we've already pulled some amazing cards. So, yeah, things are going great right now. I mean, good. That uh, that new One Piece episode was lit. I haven't caught up yet, so please don't spoil it. I haven't caught up. Um, what I usually do, I don't know if I said this when you were um. I don't know if I said this already when you uh, like followed me recently, but um, what I usually do when I after I catch up on um, on One Piece, I usually uh, wait like I would say for a couple weeks so it can like release a couple more episodes and then um, and then when I decide to catch up on the show, I binge watch those couple episodes that released. So. Yeah, please don't spoil. <laughs> I don't know much about Pokemon besides pop culture stuff, and I won't spoil for you. Sweet, but I mean, if it's a if it's a you know a good episode, then I have something to look forward to, right? But yeah, Pokemon Pokemon is another franchise or another uh, anime series, I guess. Um, I grew up with, and I play all of like. All of the main games yeah all of the main games um i used to watch the anime 
Well, I watched the anime growing up, but um, I don't watch it anymore to this day. Uh, but I still play the video games. Um, I recently started collecting the the cards, so yeah. Um, yeah, I just love I love the Pokemon franchise, Pokemon anime, just anything Pokemon. Um, but yeah, it is indeed a good episode. Well, gotta I gotta see it then. <laughs> But yeah, I hope you're having a good weekend, Gopies. Um, and a great night tonight. Alright, we got Psychic Energy. Honey. Alright. Impact Energy. Path to the Peak. That's how I feel about One Piece, to be honest. Yeah. Bound sweet. Yeah, I would say the the three I guess anime I grew up with. Well, I guess One Piece I didn't really. Well, I guess One Piece is one of the animes I kind of grew up with. Um, but the three I would say the three main anime and anime slash franchise I grew up with are Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, and One Piece, I would say. I would say Digimon too, I guess, because I did like watch a lot of Digimon growing up as well, but nowadays I haven't been watching Digimon or even collecting the cards or even play a lot of the games. So I guess Digimon kind of uh, fell off my interest, but yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh, One Piece, and Pokemon are, I guess, my main three of my childhood anime. It's awesome. All right, Cup Fu. Some chaos from time to time, but other than that, it's been fine. Ah, I gotcha. Well, hopefully, hopefully, uh, things get better. Of course. Oh, NK. Sorry. Diglett. Score Bunny. Reverse Hollow Sneasel. Ooh, excuse me. And our rare for this pack is Zarud. We don't have this one, so this is awesome. Zarud. Which is a uh, another mythic. That's awesome. We don't have Zaru, so that's awesome that we pulled that. Uh, for Pokemon, the Pokemon that I really liked was Charizard and Pikachu. I mean, that's... I feel like that's to be... I'm not, I'm not, of course I'm not, um... I'm not hating on that, but... I feel like a lot of people that doesn't know... Um, that doesn't know Pokemon as well as like actual fans I guess um or probably Pikachu and Charizard because you know Pikachu is basically the mascot of uh Pokemon and Charizard well Pokemon always shows favoritism towards Charizard and I hate that honestly I really hate that uh Charizard has showed a lot of favoritism in the franchise but I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is, but yeah, I just I don't honestly don't like the favoritism that Pokemon has been giving Charizard. But that's just my opinion. I know a lot of people like Charizard. I mean, I think Charizard's cool. Yes, I think I I I think I do I do think I should say I do think Charizard is a cool Pokemon. But just the amount of favoritism that uh, the Pokemon franchise has been giving Charizard is just lame, and not the not the other, uh, not the other like Kanto starters, I guess. Yeah, and the only reason I didn't watch Pokemon is because Ash doesn't age. I just think he looks cool. That's all. To be honest, I understand that. I understand that. I mean, and I do agree with um, Ash not aging, 
I wish because Pokemon has been going like Pokemon. I think they just celebrated their 25th year this year, or they are still celebrating their 25th year. Um, this year, and I feel like they should make Ash age in the show. Like, not not a lot. I mean, you know, because in a lot of anime, right? A lot of anime, they don't characters don't really age that often i guess i guess like in some anime you would get like one time skip right like like one piece for example right there is one time skip uh in one piece and you know i think like a uh a two-year uh a two-year time skip so yeah they do age like one time in in, in one piece but yeah i think Actually, I think Ash did age once in the show, but he only, like, I think he only aged, like, up only one year. I don't remember when that happened, which series of Pokemon that happened, but I believe he did age, like, one year. I don't know, but yeah, there are, there are, I mean, yeah, I mean, typically anime characters or characters in anime don't age even though the series have been going on for like years and years so i don't know people like it people don't i mean it is what it is if i did watch pokemon it would be the og series only it's understandable it's understandable i think only like a couple people or most people who are a fan or were a fan of pokemon um they would only watch the original series and played the first gen games like blue red yellow like the original like gen 1 games and they would just stop there they won't move on from they won't move on to the you know other generation of games or even continue what like continue watching the anime past the kanto region so yeah i mean i don't know i think for me i just love pokemon too much to just stop <laughs> so yeah i love i love pokemon i love one piece I mean, I guess Yu-Gi-Oh! in a sense is starting to fall fall off my interest a little bit because I don't watch the Yu-Gi-Oh! show anymore and I barely collect the cards nowadays too. Um, so yeah, I still have like, I still have an interest in, in the Yu-Gi-Oh! franchise and, um, and the cards and stuff, but it's just falling less and less. I guess nowadays because back then growing up I would collect a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh cards as well I would buy a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh cards and um, I would play the game a lot as well like the physical card game I mean I still do to this day but not as much as I did growing up but yeah um, yeah Yu-Gi-Oh is starting to be one of those uh, franchise slash anime series that um, that's falling off of my interest Respect to Pokemon though for being that popular, yeah, yeah. Alright. Steel energy. Echoing horn. Cybolt. Curlia. Venipede. Feel. I mean, there's another thing. There's another thing um, about Pokemon. Like the more, like the more, like um, after like the next generation comes around in Pokemon, I feel like they are starting to run out of ideas when it comes to designs of Pokemon. So yeah, I feel like they're just running out of ideas when it comes to designing Pokemon nowadays when it comes to newer generations but I mean it is what it is it makes it interesting I guess how do I feel about Digimon so I um as I said earlier I did grow up watching Digimon as well 
Um, Digimon, I do, I like Digimon, but I don't know anything about the newer Digimon series, if they're still showing Digimon, um, like newer Digimon uh, anime. I know they did like a reboot of um, the original Digimon series pretty recently, um, but I haven't watched it. I haven't been watching Digimon for a long time now. I haven't played any of the recent Digimon games or even collect the Digimon cards. So Digimon was a yeah was a series slash like anime franchise or whatever that did fell off fall off my interest uh, as I got older. But when I was younger, I did love Digimon. Digimon, Pokemon were. I know Digimon and Pokemon were, you know, kind of competing, sort of, but I did like Digimon as well. Um, I did watch a lot of the um, older anime series of Digimon. Um, I believe the last Digimon series that I watched was Digimon Frontier. It's, it's the series where the, the, the kids actually turn into the Digimon. Um, but I think after Frontier, I, I stopped watching Digimon. I lost interest at, after that, I think. Um, I don't even think I played a lot of the older Digimon games growing up either. There was like, um, I think the only Digimon game I really played growing up was Digimon Arena, I believe that was called. It was either on the PS1 or PS2, but it was like a side-scrolling, side-scrolling, um, fighting, fighting game. I believe it was like similar to Smash Brothers, I guess. Like the fighting style of that game was similar to Smash Brothers. Um, but that that game was pretty cool. But yeah, after after Digimon Frontier, I did lose interest in the show or in the shows, the anime, the just the 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 franchise as a whole. But yeah, yeah. Nowadays, I don't really watch Digimon or just have an interest in Digimon anymore. Crab Brawler, Golet, Oregon, Ooh, Reverse Hollow Urshifu, Single Strike. I believe we have the uh, a Reverse Hollow of the Rapid Strike Urshifu, which is cool. Yeah, it's been a while, I just remembered it being a popular thing for my elementary school. Yeah. Well, actually. I don't think, I don't know, I don't think uh, a lot of kids in my school watched Digimon growing up. But oh well. Well, may I have to go to bed since it's midnight and I had fun watching and chatting with you. I hope you have a blessed nay slash, nay, day slash night. I appreciate that, man. I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you for stopping by. Um, I hope you have a great rest of your weekend. Um, have a great rest. Enjoy the rest of your night. And uh, yeah, hope to see you later. Okay. And our rare for this pack is... Seviper. Non, Non-hollow. That's a cool artwork though. Okay. that there okay I know I know we're not probably guaranteed to pull a gold rare card but I do hope we pull at least one gold rare I do hope we pull at least one gold rare um, card in this pack or in this box uh, those yeah so we are an hour an hour into the stream and uh, i still don't know if we're halfway through the box yet oh but it's fine come on there we go Okay, 
Co card for you guys. Electric energy. Reboot. Rapid Strike Scroll of Skies. Curlia. Aaron. Ralts. Then a P. Oops, sorry. Bound Sweet. Lapras. Obama Snow. That is our reverse hollow. We don't have an Obama Snow, I don't think. So that's awesome. And our rare for this pack is another Surviper. Wow. What are the chances? <laughs> All right. Let's pull from. Let's get a pack from the back on the right side. Ultras artwork. I honestly, I honestly really like the, uh, like the design of the Chilling Rain uh, artwork. Like I like the the logo of the Chilling Rain pa uh, packs or pack set or whatever. Um. And yeah, I just like the 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 artwork Pokemon they put on the Chilling Rain packs. Okay. Code card for you guys. Okay. It's steel energy. Clara. Haunter. We still haven't pulled a Gengar yet, so that's pretty unfortunate. Flannery. Mareep. Heracross. Babapus. Rookie Sneasel Reverse Hollow uh, Galarian Chest Plate. I wonder why they added Galarian before Chest Plate. Like, was there just a normal Chest Plate in the earlier sets or something? Because, yeah, I don't know. And our rare for this pack is. A a full art Avery trainer card. That's awesome. This is actually my first uh regular full art trainer card because the other full art trainer cards that I have are both rainbow rare. Um, so the first one I got was Chairman Rose. And the second one, as I mentioned um, earlier, was a uh, Rainbow Rare uh, Cheryl. So this is my first, like, regular, my first regular full art uh, trainer card. That's awesome. I mean, even though I don't know, 
like how this guy is in the game, but from what Bot told me last night, he's a bit of a a dick. Cause this guy's only in the shield games. Uh, but yeah, in shield, and I have sword, so I get Avery, and Avery's Avery's also pretty much a a jerk of a character. So I'm pretty sure they're those, you know, the same same attitude character. But yeah. That's awesome. We got our very first uh, regular full art A oh, full art Avery, full art uh, trainer card. Awesome. I do like also that um that like some of these uh some of these full art cards are textured, like they have like s like some sort of like texture to them, because this one does have like a texture to it, and so does the uh. So does the the Metagross V Max that we pulled, the Rainbow Rare, it does have like a texture to it, which is you can kind of see the texture too, like if I shine it at like a certain angle. But yeah, I do like how like nowadays in like in newer Pokemon sets, like the full art cards, are, like have like a some texture feel to the art, which is fancy. Okay, Ice Rider Calyrex there. Okay, so we got we got our Shadow Rider Calyrex. Um, we still I still want to get we still gotta get uh, a Zapdos. So gotta get Zapdos. We still gotta get a. Uh, Rapidash, uh, Blissey, and Shiny Snorlax from the list, I guess, if you want to call it that, of ones that I really want to get from this set, but, I mean, so far, we've been getting some amazing cards, so, I'm not complaining, really, so, yeah, I mean, I just, I hope we do get, um, one of the cards that are on my list. Okay. Okay. All right. Water energy. Ladian or Lady Ladian? Wait, Ladian. However you pronounce it. <laughs> Alright. Old Cemetery. Impact Energy. Vaults. Heracross. Sunny form cast form. Sphiel. Atena. Ooh. Another card we don't have. Verse Hollow Frostlass. That's awesome. And our rare for this pack is. Thunderous. So we got a regular Hollow Thunderous this time. Which is cool. We got a Reverse Hollow Thunderous and a regular Hollow Thunderous. That's cool. Alright, we're gonna put this in a set, or in a set, in a sleeve. And if you're wondering why I don't put um, reverse hollows in sleeves, despite them being, you know, basically a hollow card, is because, um, is because you are guaranteed a reverse hollow in every pack, so it's not as special. But, yeah. But, you know, you're not always guaranteed a regular hollow card in a pack. So that's why I put, like, regular hollows and, um, of course, full art hollows and sleeves. 
but yeah you are guaranteed you are you are like guaranteed a reverse hollow in every pack as you can see we've been getting you know a reverse a reverse hollow in every pack we've opened tonight and every other night so yeah that's why i'm not that's why if you're wondering why i haven't been or yeah i don't put reverse hollow cards and sleeves that's the reason all right oh articuno artwork Hey, okay. still hoping for something from our list. We only got one thing from our list so far. Here's a code card. But yeah, we only got um, Shadow Rider Calyrex is from our list. So yeah, we still have a couple more from our list that we uh, I want to get. From this set excuse me <laughs> but if we don't get it i mean that's fine again we did we did uh we did get like amazing cards still from this from tonight so far so yeah all right psychic energy yeah oregon 2 wacky Echoing Horn, Rock Rough, Shop It, Snowy Form, Cast Form, Ghastly, Up Foo, Reverse Hollow Deerling. And our rare for this pack is another Kecleon. Non hollow. Alright. Do do. I think we're almost halfway done through the box. Not sure really, but I think we are. So One, another Articuno. Okay. Got Grass Energy. Reboot. Agatha. Fog Crystal. Rookie. Mareep. Rock Ruff. Swirlix, oh look at that. Look at that cute thing. Swirlix. Yep. Lapras. Reverse hollow Ralts. And our rare for this pack is Shiny or not shiny, I guess. I should stop saying that, <laughs> honestly. Because I know that's gonna be confusing. But we got a regular Hollow Frost last. Sorry. Trying to adjust the piles. 
So we did pull a reverse hollow frost last earlier, but this time around we have a shiny or stop calling it shiny. <laughs> um regular hollow frost last. That's awesome. Did the music stop again? Yes it did. Ooh, right. So I'm gonna put this in the sleeve. Bear with me. I know I'm pretty sure most people don't put the regular hollows in the sleeve. But I don't know. I'll I'll put the regular hollows in sleeves and including you know along with the full art cards. But those are still considered rare, I guess. Alright. So so far in this box, we haven't gotten duplicates for tonight. We did get duplicates of last night's polls. Like when it comes to the uh, the full arts, but we haven't you know we haven't gotten a duplicate of tonight, like another like a duplicate of tonight's polls. Because I remember, if I remember correctly, we did get some duplicate uh, duplicate hollows in the um, yeah we did get duplicate hollows in um, in the battle styles booster box opening we did. I think we got two full art Victini V cards. And I think two regular uh, Steelix Hollow cards, if I remember correctly. I think those two are the only ones we got duplicates of that night. But tonight, I don't think we've had uh, any duplicates of rare cards. Or, yeah, of Hollow cards. Which is interesting. Which is uh, very interesting. Okay. There is your code card. Okay. Got fire energy. Just to fight gloves. Lucky energy. Orion 2, Ladybug, Golette, Babapis, yeah. Snowy Form, Cast Form, Atena, come on, oh, Reverse, Hollow, Clubopus and our rare for this pack is ooh surfetch we don't have a surfetch so that's awesome I don't know if this card comes in a regular hollow or not but hey we got something that we don't have so that's awesome I'll take it okay Moving on, Battle Rider. I also need to get another binder. I need to get a binder for, uh, or a binder to put together, um, the Battle Style set and the, and this, and the Chilling Ring set in one binder since you know, they're both based off of the uh, the DLC in Sword and Shield. So, I would like to put them in the same binder. There's your code card. Mm 
Okay. Got steel energy. Scroll of piercing. Avery. Wacky. Galarian Farfetched. Rainy Form Cast Form. Larvesta. Sobble. Ladybug. Reverse Hollow Rainy Form Cast Form. I swear this been this happens a lot. I feel like this happens a lot when I uh, when I open packs. You'll get like a, a common, f like a regular version of the card or of a of a card in you know in a pack, and then once you reach the the reverse hollow, is the reverse hollow of that same of the of the you know the earlier card or one of the earlier cards in that same pack. That's interesting. All right, and our rare for this pack is Ooh, Galarian Slow King. Hell yeah. That's awesome. We got Galarian Slow King. We don't have that. I don't I don't know if um I don't think Galarian Slow Bros in this set. I don't remember if I saw Galarian Slowbro in this set. Hey, okay. I'll take this. I'll take Galarian Slow King. Something we don't have, so that's cool. Okay. That there. All right. So, all trust. Still hoping to get Zapdos. I guess the main, the main, the main one on my list uh, to get is Zapdos because I do want to complete the trio, and then I guess after Zapdos, um, I would want to get the uh, the Rapid Dash, that like pretty looking rap like alternate art or Galarian Rapid Dash. But so far, no dice. Again, we only we've only pulled our uh, Shadow Rider Calyrex so that's on the list. But other than that, we haven't gotten anything else from our list. But we still have a, a few more, a couple or a lot more packs to go. So hopefully, one of those packs has something from our list. All right, Grass Energy, Scroll of Piercing. Melanie Expedition Uniforms Swirlix Ah, come on. There we go. Galarian Yamask Sunny Form Cast Form Regular Cast Form. I swear this happens a lot too. Lady buff. Ooh, reverse. Reverse hollow Porygon 2. We still haven't gotten Porygon Z, I believe. I think Porygon Z is in this set. Um Yeah. And our rare for this pack is Galarian Weezing, which we also put last night in one of the uh ETB packs. But this is I don't know if this comes in a hollow version, but this is a non-hollow version. Or non-hollow rare, I mean. 
Okay. Ice Rider. Your co card. Excuse me. All right, fighting energy. Ooh, Laron. I don't think we have a Laron. We didn't get Agron either, I don't think. Hey Blazing, I'm late again, but seems you have some nice pulls from this box. Heck yeah! Welcome! How you doing? Hopefully you're having a, a great weekend. Welcome! Fire resistance glove. Fire resistant gloves. But yeah, we did get um some amazing pulls so far. I'll show you what we got um after after this pack here. Welcoming lantern. How's your weekend? Coughing. Good thing. Just got back from a bike ride, same as yesterday. Nice. How'd that go? Hopefully, you had a, a nice bike ride. Deli Bird. Galarian Farfetched. Oregon. Heracross. Reverse Hollow Caitlyn. And our rare for this pack is. Well, speak of the devil. <laughs> I just said that we haven't gotten an Agron yet, and look what we got as our rare. That's awesome. Non shiny Agron, but hey, we got an Agron. It's a card that we don't have. All right, hope your weekend was has been enjoyable. Yeah, it's been good. Um, of course, you were there yesterday, but uh, yeah, we did a ETB or two or two uh, killing rain ETB uh, openings and got some cool cards from that. And tonight, uh, yeah, we're doing the same, but we're doing a booster box opening, and we're getting some awesome pulls tonight as well. But yeah, other than that, uh, you know, my weekend's been good. Nothing really special. Just been, you know, chilling, playing games, and all that. <laughs> but yeah, so we got, so we pulled for our regular hollows, anyways. We got Galarian Slowking, Frostlass, Thunderous. Zarud, Cinderace, and Hatterene. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Those are pretty awesome. So for our uh, pull art Vs, we got Shadow Rider Calyrax V, which is one of the cards that I wanted on the list, or on my list of cards I wanted to pull from this box or from the set in general. Uh, another Metagross V. Or this not in view. But yeah, we, we pulled this yesterday, so we got a duplicate. And then our very first V uh full art, full art V card we pulled tonight was uh Zara Aura, which is really awesome. That artwork looks amazing. I'm pretty sure it doesn't look as good. Because um, again, I'm using the sleeves from uh, from the ETB, and the transparent the transparency of the sleeves from the ET uh, from the sleeves from the ETB um, aren't really as transparent. I guess that's kind of ruining how the cards look. But hey, like I said, I'm using what I got. I don't have any other sleeves to put these cards in. So yeah. So for V Max, this is my this is my second ever V Max card. As I mentioned before, I have a uh, H slash V Max, a regular like regular uh, H slash V Max, and we pulled this bad boy, this Metagross V like Rainbow Rare Metagross V Max, 
So this is my very second one ever. And to have it be a rainbow rare is amazing. Like I got, I was really happy to pull this one. Ultra Pro Penny Sleeves are great if you find them. And also Ultra Pro Top Loaders for the best cards. Yeah, yeah. I know about um, Ultra Pro. I'm just like, I mean, just in general, um, I'm just using what I have right now. Um, I don't think I'll really buy any other sleeves, honestly, since I'm not. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure, I mean, I'm pretty sure these sleeves will do fine, I guess. It's just, you know, of course, the only gripe that people have with, uh, the only gripe with people have with the uh, ETB sleeves are the trans the, the transparent front part of the of the sleeve isn't like clear transparent it's like a more blurry ish transparent but yeah and then we pulled this guy here all well, our Avery so this this is actually my um this is actually my uh very first regular full art trainer card and as i also mentioned earlier that um the other two the two trainer the only two other uh full art trainer cards i have are both rainbow rares so the first one i got is um ra a rainbow rare full art uh chairman rose from i believe vivid voltage is either vivid voltage or uh I don't remember where that's what set it's from. Vivid Voltage or uh, Darkness of Blaze or Rebel Rebel Clash or whatever that that set is called. One of those. I don't know. But and then um, yeah, the Battle Styles or um, the other Full Art Rainbow uh, printer card I got was Cheryl. Oh, you were there when I pulled that one. But yeah, um, yeah. That Rainbow Rare Cheryl Full Art Trainer card. So yeah, those two are the uh, only, or were the only two Full Art Trainer cards I had until we pulled this regular Full Art Avery card, which is cool. So, um, in case you don't know Blazing, um, I do have a, a certain list of cards I do want to pull from this set. It's in the it's in the stream title. Um, but in case you can't see it, because I know it, it does get cut off, but I do want to pull a shine, the shiny Snorlax, same as you. I'm pretty sure you mentioned this um, the other day. I do want to pull the shiny Snorlax or the shiny Electro, but I do want to pull the shiny Snorlax more. Like I want that more than the Electrode. Um, I do want to get just Zapdos V to complete the trio birds because we do we already pulled uh, Articuno and Moltres so I do want to get Zapdos um, Shadow Rider Calyrex was one of them uh, and we did pull a Shadow Rider Calyrex um, I do want to get uh, I don't know if you I'm pretty sure you saw the the set list for this for the uh, Chilling Rain but I do want to get that alternate um, that alternate artwork for Galarian Rapidash that looks so freaking pretty um it just looks like really pretty i don't know how to i don't know how else to describe it but when i saw it in the uh the uh, the player guidebook from the etb like it looks freaking pretty <laughs> but um yeah i want to get that and then i want to get um either one of the blissey v cards because blissey is awesome <laughs> gold electro looks awesome there's so many nice cards in the set yeah yeah i agree like when i when i saw the set list in the the player guidebook from the etb out man all the like yeah there were a lot of like awesome looking cards in this set it's like freaking yeah it's amazing so yeah those cards that i just mentioned are my list of cards I want to pull. I really do hope I uh, get a Zapdos because I really want to complete the trio. So hopefully we get Zapdos tonight and then after Zapdos maybe the Rapidash or the Shiny Snorlax. So yeah. I mean if we get Ice Rider 
Ice Rider Calyrex, that would be awesome too, but that's not on my list really. But I wouldn't complain if we did get it. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So Shiny Snorlax, or Zapdos, Shiny Snorlax, and then Rapidash. So let's hope, let's hope, let's hope. Okay. There's uh, your code card for whoever plays the online game. Alright. Alright. I'm pretty sure we're halfway through the box now. I'm pretty sure at least. All right, we've got Electric Energy, Ball Crystal, Yonia, Rollipede, Weedle, Clobopus. Marie, sorry if the top down cam is going out of focus. Ralts. Cast form, or yeah, rainy form cast form. Our reverse hollow is Grookie. And our rare for this pack is. Yo, another VMAX! Stella B VMAX! Oh shit, look at that. That looks amazing. My third VMAX. I, went, I did not expect to pull another VMAX card in this box. Holy shit. I honestly did not expect to pull another VMAX card from this box. That is amazing. The centering looks good from your packs. I can't tell, like, okay, I know I know a lot of people, I know a lot of Pokemon card collectors talk about centering. I don't know what that means, really. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Yeah, I've heard, I've heard, I've been hearing a lot of, like, Pokemon card collectors talk about centering. Look, the silver borders? Oh, you're talking about these borders out here? I've seen some boxes open on Twitch and the quality control has been poor. Oh, uh, you want, uh, you want the look, or you want the, to look equal left, right, and up and down. Also, you can see on the back of the card with the blue borders. Uh, I don't think that's really good centered on the back. Because I think the border on the, the, the right here is a little th uh, much thinner than the border on the left. I don't know if you can tell. But yeah, it's not really good on the on the bag, I guess. But hey. I'm not complaining. <laughs> it's a good card still. But it's okay. Not very... Not every card will be perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But again, we are getting cards that are not on my list. But hey. Again, I'm not complaining. It's cards that we don't have. And it's a VMAX card nonetheless. So I am very happy about this. I am very happy about this. My third ever VMAX. So amazing. Well, um, actually, I'm gonna move this because this is technically a rainbow rare first. So, our first VMAX rare for the night, which is awesome. 
That's amazing. That's amazing. I think, I already think, so far, I think this Chilling Rain box is already better than uh, the Battle Styles. I don't know. To me, I think this Chilling Rain box is already better than the Battle Styles box we did the other night. I know we don't we didn't we didn't get any um we didn't get any uh <clears throat> or a gold card from this box yet. I don't know or I can't say yet, but we still have a couple packs left in the in the box here. But um we haven't pulled a a gold card yet. But if we do, that then this this box here is definitely better than the battle styles box we did the other night. Alright. Moltres. But yeah, I feel like so far this this Chilling Rain box tonight is already better than the Battle Styles box we did. Because getting getting two VMAX cards already that's already that's already better than the Battle Styles box. Cause I didn't even get a single VMAX card from uh, the Battle Styles box. But I got two, and one of them, one of the uh, VMAX cards is a Rainbow Rare, so that's amazing. That's amazing. I'm happy about that one. Okay. Go card for you guys. Oop, excuse me. Dark energy, crushing gloves, honey, impact energy, snover, valerian yaw mask. Coughing. Focus, please. Thank you. Shop it. Squall vet. Reverse hollow Ampharos. And our rare for this pack is. Ooh, Skull Peak. We don't have this. It's a non-rare or non-hollow Skull P, but it's a card that we don't have, so I'm happy. I don't know if there's a hollow version of this, but hey. That's awesome. Uh do 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 get this one. Glaring Articuno. Oh yeah, I'm sure right now we are more than we're like over halfway done with this box now. I just hope my phone, my top-down cam, doesn't die on me. Maybe I should plug it in. I don't know what the battery is at right now. Oh card. Still looking for that Zapdos. Electric Energy. Expedition Uniform. Petrum. Laffy. Diglett. Bullet. Dearly, Sneasel. I just realized there's a an Obama snow in the back behind the uh, the Sneasel here. 
Air across. Ooh, hey, boar. A uh, boar. Porygon Z. Awesome. A card we don't have yet. First rare Porygon Z. And our rare is. Hold on. Just realized. Look how intense that artwork looks like. It's a pretty, uh, pretty cool artwork for Porygon Z. Alright, and our rare is another Obama Snow. Another Obama Snow non hollow. Okay. Um, let's see. Go from the front here. Got that Zapdos artwork. Okay, we're at the home stretch. It's only like, I would say, looks like maybe 10 pack left, maybe, I would say. 10 or so packs left. There you guys go. Okay. Fighting energy. Cybold. Oh, I still don't know how to pronounce the guy's name, so I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong. Curlia. Agatha. Atena. Zobble. Bounce Sweet. Burfro. Diglett. Lucky Energy. Oh, that's a reverse or reverse hollow. Lucky Energy. And our rare for this pack is Weezing, non hollow Weezing. Okay. That Shadow Rider Calyrex here. Eh, come on, there we go. Damn boy, there's some sexy cards in the back. That Celebi looks gor uh, glorious. Yeah. That thing looks awesome, doesn't it? Welcome, bot. How you doing? Welcome. Yeah. I also put this bad boy here. A Rainbow Rare Metagross VMAX. Freaking, this box is already amazing. This one, this one's already better than the Battle Styles uh, booster box that I pulled uh, or that I opened the other night. We also got a regular, uh, regular Avery full art card, which is neat. Even though he's a dick, from what you said, <laughs> that's still cool. All right, let me show you the other uh, rare cards we got. So we got, so this is for the uh, regular holo cards. So we got Galarian Slowking, Frostlass, Thunderous, Zarud, Cinderace, and ha uh, Hatterene. Just loaded up Shield, decided to try get the rest of the legends instead of starting fresh. For that Metagross though, yeah, that Metagross. I think that was, I think that was right up on the list. Really? So our as for our regular V cards, 
uh we got shadow rider calyrex v which is one of the cards that um that was on my list to pull from this set so i'm happy that we got this shadow rider it looks so cool too and then we got another metagross v uh, you were there bob we pulled this last night and then our first our first v uh that v full art card that we pulled tonight was this zara aura This is our aura looks really cool. But yeah. I would say Yeah. The best one was the the Metagross V that we pulled. Uh I don't remember, do I no I didn't. Okay. I didn't do the four cards in the front. Loves our aura? Yeah, Zara Aura looks cool. Yeah, I like the design. I do too. Um, he's white and amazing. Yeah, cause um, I believe Pokemon gave out. I don't know if they did it for uh in in New Zealand, but they did give out a code to get a shiny Zara Aura through like uh through um mystery gift. I don't know because I think they did that here in the States um, I don't know if they did that in like other countries but that's cool that you have one I actually have two the first one I bought off eBay <laughs> then they gave one out oh, I got you I got you I got you that's cool I think it was to do with Pokemon home ah uh, I see, I see. Alright, we got Dark Energy. Oh shoot, wait, hold on. This Dark Energy has to go into the Reverse Hollow. Uh, sorry, Pile getting out of order. Alright, cool. Fog Crystal. Brawly. Speaking of um, speaking of catching the legendaries, I haven't since I haven't been um, playing my sword, my Pokemon Sword game. I haven't also caught all the legendaries from the Dynamax Adventures. I still need to do that, but just haven't gotten the interest to play Pokemon Sword anymore. But I mean, I said this earlier, but um, after opening, you know doing some Pokemon card opening packs, it kind of gave me some interest to play Pokemon Sword again. Alright, we got Celio. Sorry. Blitzel. Aeron. Deerling. Jelly Bird, Larvesta, Reverse Hollow Dynatree Hill. That Metagross is market price seventeen dollars. Ah, it's fine. It's still a cool card for me. To me, so even though it's not worth much, it's fine. I like it. All right, our rare for this pack is Yo, are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> Holy shit. Are you fucking kidding me right now? We got the regular Metagross VMAX. Oh my god. That is freaking amazing. That is amazing. That is freaking amazing.
I mean, technically it's a duplicate, but hey, it's a duplicate I welcome. Hold on. I gotta do this. Gotta do the side by side. Always gotta do the side by side. Look at that. Regular Metagross VMAX and Rainbow Metagross VMAX. That is amazing. This is for sure. This is for sure better. Uh, better than the the battle styles box I did. That is awesome. Now you guys get to see the side by side there, in the back. That is fucking amazing. Sorry, the music stopped again. Oh man, out of pure curiosity, that Metagross VMAX and the Celebi VMAX are both market price three dollars. That's so sick though. Yeah, I don't really. I don't really care about worth. I mean, I, I'm not planning to sell them, honestly. You have to get a massive wall frame for all these rare cards. Hell yeah! I do have like a like um, because my bed is like right next to my desk right here. Um, I do have like a empty space of wall that's like right next to my bed that uh, that it's against. So um. I used to I used to hang um, a one piece flag, uh, the one piece straw hats flag on that wall or on that space wall space, but I took it down, so now it's just bare a bare wall right there. So I might do that actually, just hang it there and just display all these awesome cars that we got. But yeah, that would be cool. That would be cool. I should do that. All right. Let's, uh, let's get this one. Sorry. I'm not crying, I swear. <laughs> These are not tears. Alright. Get that Shadow Rider. But still, yeah, I'm... I want to get... I still want to get a Zapdos V to complete the trio. And then after Zapdos, I do want to get a... Uh, Rapidash, a Rapidash, or um, the shiny Snorlax. But yeah, so far um, from our list, our wish list of cards, we only got one out of that wish list, and that was uh, the Shadow Rider Calyrex. So yeah, I don't know. I I mean, as how many car, how many um, packs we have left, I doubt we'll pull any of the cards. We'll we'll want on our list but hey something it's something right there's a game on switch down from 545 to one ascent must be so good damn all right there's your code card okay all right sorry I'm sure the, the, the pile here looks kind of crooked, but it's not not really as crooked as it looks like on the, on the top-down cam. Okay. We got Fighting Energy. Haunter. Flannery. Focus. Focus, thank you. Abominable. Galarian Yaw Mask. Coughing. Up it. Squaw Vet. Sphere. Reverse Hollow. Path to the Peak. And our rare for this pack is a Golurk, non-hollow Golurk. It's a card we don't have, so I'm happy. Even though it's not um, a hollow, it's a card we don't have, so 
I'll take it. We don't have a goal work, so that's awesome. Okay, next pack. The Shadow Rider. Flannery. Oh, another Flannery. Old Cemetery. Steeny. Larvesta. Inke. Lockruff. Ghastly. Focus. Ladybug. Reverse Hollow Yaw Mask. And our rare for this pack is. Banette. Non Hollow Banette. Rider okay. your code card. energy lucky energy Oregon 2 oh wait sorry put the reverse hollow yaw mask in the wrong pile all right reboot or or Sorry, Weedle, Club Office, Mareep, Ralts, Rainy Form, Cast Form, Reverse Hollow, Atena. And our rare is another Agron, non-hollow. Okay. Okay. Articuno. Uh, 
Okay. Electric energy. Avery. Ladian. Old Cemetery. Heracross. Sobble. Inkay. Squavet. Come on, focus. Thank you. Score Bunny. Reverse Hollow Volcarona. I believe we already got this. That's cool. Alright. And our rare in this. Oh, rare. Yeah, our rare for this pack is. Another Scolopee. Non. Non hollow. Okay. See, we got we got six packs left, guys. Six packs left. Ultras. Cut. Here is a code card. I think our luck is starting to dwindle down after that Metacross VMAX. Okay. Fire energy. Agatha. Flannery. Old Cemetery. Brookie. Mareep. Akrof. Orlix, Lapras, Reverse Hollow Spiral Energy, and our rare for this pack is Ooh Gallade, a non-hollow Gallade, but that looks really cool. We don't have this, so. Hey, that's awesome. Sorry, wanted to get a closer look at this. Yeah, non holocal 8. That's, that's a cool, cool artwork. There is a Guard of War in this set as well, which we haven't pulled yet. So. Don't know if we'll have a chance to. Okay. Go card. Oh, wait. What? Oh, I messed up. I put three instead of one, uh, four. Sorry. I was like, there was a Pokemon in front. Sorry. I messed up. But, yeah. Um, fire energy. Drop the bomb, metable. 
Scroll of Piercing. Melanie. Sneasel. Sobble. Inkay. Squavet. Score Bunny. Ooh, Inteleon, hell yeah. Reverse Hollow Inteleon. We don't have this, so that's awesome. And our rare for this pack is... Ooh, Lightbird. A Lightbird V. That looks awesome. That looks really cool. Down to four, our final four guys. Do this one. Larian Zapdos. Ooh, excuse me. Great. Psychic energy. Brawly. Celio. Clara. Sveal. Swirlix. Yamask. Sunny form, cast form. Nover. Oh, we got a reverse hollows of root this time around. Okay. And our rare for this pack is Greedent. The shiny or shiny hollow greed ant. A card we don't have, but I'll take it, you know. I gotta say though, this is a this is kind of a an odd one to have shiny or hollow. Hey. Okay. A hollow is a hollow, I guess. This in the sleeve. That there. All right. Okay. Moltres. Down to our last three. Only two more after this one.
x Okay. Got psychic energy. Dynatree Hill. Spiral energy. Yoni. Porygon. Swirlix. Sneasel, Snover, Blitzel, oh, Reverse Hollow, uh, Reverse Hollow, Hattering this time. Nice. And our rare for this pack is. Ooh, Sawsbuck! That's pretty. We don't have this yet, so... That's awesome. That's a non-hollow sauce bug, but I will take it. Okay. Final two. Our second to last is a Articuno artwork. Resistant gloves, found sweet, hub foo, inke, diglet, score bunny, reverse. Hollow Laron. I swear, this happens way, way too often. We got a, a regular Laron earlier. Now we got a reverse rare Laron. Alright. And our rare for this pack is. Cobalion. Cobalion. Okay, Cobalion Shiny. Normal Hollow Cobra Lion. That's cool. We don't have this one either, so that's. I don't think the other two are in this. Uh, I don't think Verizian or Terrakian are in this. In this set, I don't know why they don't include them. Okay. go all right guys we are down to our last pack let's see if we can end it with a bang last pack of the night will we end it with a bang
food card. All right. Hey, steel energy. Path to the peak. Drizile. Dynatree Hill. Sveal. Swirlix. Yamask. Sunny form, cast form. Regular cast form. I s <laughs> this happened like a lot. Like having like another form of cast form and then on the back a regular cast form. I don't know if they do this on purpose, but I don't know. <laughs> Weeding gloves is our reverse hollow. And our rare for our final pack is Slurpuff. Sally's not shiny either, but that is it, everyone. That is all the cards that we've opened in our booster box. Gotta say, do gotta say though. This Chilling Rain's uh, Chilling Rain booster box was definitely, definitely better than the Battle Styles booster box we opened. Um, sadly, we didn't get uh, a gold rare in this one like we did in the Battle Styles one, and we didn't get any other cards from our wish list. If you want to call it that, um, wish list of cards that we want to get from this set, aside from the. Uh, Shadow Rider, um, Calyrex, V that we pulled earlier. But hey, I am not upset at all. I am not upset at all that we didn't get all the like most of the cards from um, from our wish wish list. I, I, I am kind of bummed out that I wasn't able to pull a, a Zapdos V because I I really wanted to you know complete the trio, the bird trio. But hey. I'm happy with what we got tonight, and um, here's a final look at the shinies we got today, or hollows, sorry. So start off with the regular hollows. So we got Cobalion, Greedent, Slowking, Frostlass, Thunderous, Zarude, Cinderace, and uh, Hatterene. Then moving over to the full art V cards, we got Lightbird V, Shadow Rider, uh, Shadow Rider Calyrex V, Metagross V, and Zara Aura V. So another thing that hasn't happened tonight that we that that did happen in um. In, um, in the battle styles booster box. We didn't get any duplicates. I know technically, I guess Meta the Metagross, the regular Metagross VMAX and the rainbow Metagross VMAX is, are, is a technically a duplicate, but they're both different rarities, so it doesn't really count. So yeah, we didn't get any duplicate uh, full arts tonight. So now we're moving on to our regular VMAX. So, Got Metagross VMAX and Celebi VMAX. Then, I'm gonna move over to our Full Art Avery card here. And then, I would say the best card we pulled tonight. The very best card we pulled tonight was this Rainbow Rare, Rainbow Hollow, Metagross VMAX. That is amazing. Honestly, the fact that we got 
both the regular regular uh, Metagross VMAX and um, the Rainbow Rare, Rainbow Hollow uh, Metagross VMAX in the same box. The odds of that happening, that's, that's insane. That's really insane, but that's awesome too. But yeah, that is it everyone. That is my opening of uh, the Chilling Rain booster box. I had a great time opening this, of course. I always have fun opening um, these Pokemon card packs. Um, and of course, I do plan on doing more, but also, of course, you know, this is a costly hobby to get into, and with a lot of, and also Pokemon cards being in high demand, so it's gonna be difficult to buy more packs. And I'm pretty sure, and also with uh, Chilling Rain just coming out this past Friday, uh, I'm pretty sure uh, the set's gonna be pretty difficult to find. Maybe, I don't know. Um, I'm pretty sure not as difficult as other sets because, of course, this set doesn't have the prize Charizard <laughs> or a Charizard in the set as a V Max or a a V full art V card so I don't think it'll be as sought after but um I don't know I don't know when when's the next time I'm gonna do more uh card openings but um hopefully it'll be soon hopefully it'll be soon um I don't know if I'll do another booster box opening because these are pretty expensive, these the booster boxes, or at least from where I got uh, the booster box, this booster box, uh, it, it did cost uh, like $108. I know they usually sell for $90, but I couldn't find I couldn't find these booster boxes anywhere else that you know would sell them for like $90-ish dollars. So. Yeah, I do agree. $108 is a good price for a booster box. At least it's not like freaking double the price. So, yeah. Um, I am happy and uh, lucky enough to uh, to be able to pre-order this Chilling Rains booster box for that price. So, that's awesome. Um, I think we will find it easy to get. One of my card shops cancel orders for battle styles due to lack of stock on release. Mm. Now they have 20 plus cases, Jesus, of Chilling Rain, that's a good price. I pay US 122 in Australia. That, that's not, I mean, in Australia dollars? I won't say that's not, that's not bad. Cause I mean, that's still close, that's a close enough price to the, well, US price. Just saying printing has really increased now, yeah, 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 that is true. That's true, because on the website from on the website of the card shop that I bought or yeah bought the this or you know bought the battle styles box from and this chilling rains box from they still they still have um they still have battle styles uh booster boxes in stock they still have battle styles ETBs in stock and I believe they still have. I think the last time I checked earlier today or yesterday, I mean, um, they still have ch uh, Chilling Rain ETBs in stock as well. But I don't know. We might see US eighty to ninety dollar boxes if they print like crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If they do, like, if they still like, if the increase of production for these cards like gets faster or more like more quantities increase hopefully the prices of the of the boxes decrease and of course the more printings that come out the less sought after the scalpers will buy them and the less value of the cards will also be decreased so then the actual collectors will be able to get their hands on it so that's awesome that's good Killing Rains is a lot better set than BS. Yeah, yeah, I would say so. I mean, but then again, I mean, Battle Styles was based off of um, 
Battle Stars was based off of uh, the Isle of Armor DLC in Sword and Shield, and Chilling Rain is based off of the Crown Tundra DLC in Sword and Shield. And I know, I'm pretty sure you say you don't play the games, but the Crown Tundra DLC has way more content than the, um, than the Isle of Armor DLC. Um, so I guess it, I guess it follows here in the, uh, in the, in the cards. So yeah, the Chilling Rains, Chilling Rain set has way better cards than the Battle Styles. I do agree with that. But yeah, I don't, I don't know when's the next time I'm going to do another, um, another pack opening. Hopefully it'll be soon. And, uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe I'll do another booster box if I get the chance to. Because I really do need to save my money as well. Because there are a lot of, there are also a lot of games that I'm looking forward to coming out this, later this year. Um, so I have to save my money for that. <laughs> but, I don't know. If I, if I can't... If I can't buy like any more like battle styles or chilling rain stuff, then yes, as you said, yeah, evolving skies is coming out in late August, so I'll probably wait for August, like yeah, around August. So that's like two months from now, I believe. So yeah, around August will probably more than likely be my next time I'll do another card opening. So. Yeah, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. Just do one box for you, for each release so it doesn't financially strain you. That is true. That is true. Maybe I will do that. That sounds like a good that actually sounds like a good plan. Honestly. Doing one booster box for each set. I think that sounds like a plan. Cause if they're releasing new sets like every two months, I think that I think that sounds good. I know they, I'm pretty sure, I know Chilling Rain just released this past Friday and then Evolving Skies is going to be releasing in late August, as you said. So that's like two months from now. So, and if, if the next set after Evolving Skies comes two months after, then yeah, I think, I think that's, that's fair. I think that's fair. Yeah, just buying one box for each set. Uh, yeah, for each release. Yeah, I think that's um, I think that's a good idea. Yeah, I like that idea honestly. You get like a fair amount of cards, and your odds of getting freaking like these amazing pulls is really good with the booster boxes. So yeah, I would say yeah, that's a good idea. I think I'll do that. But, I mean, if I do get my hands on some some cards, some more cards of the set sooner, like before Evolving Skies releases, then I'll probably do a stream for that. But if not, then yeah. More than likely, uh, my next stream will be for Evolving Skies in late August, so that'll be two months from now. But until then, I'll be doing my regular, my regular gaming streams. Um... I mean, like I said, I have a lot of games to look forward to coming out later this year and early next year as well. So yeah, I have freaking, there's uh, the Gen 4 remakes for Pokemon coming out in November. Um, there's, um, shoot, there's even Scarlet Nexus that's coming out next week. I already pre-ordered that, so I'll be starting that next week. Scarlet Nexus, yeah, Scarlet Nexus comes out next week. Uh, Tales of Arise also comes out in August, I believe. So I'll, I'm looking forward to that. Uh, Back for Blood comes out in October. Um, shoot, yeah, there's a lot of games, a lot of games that I'm looking forward to. Uh, Pokemon Legend Legends Arceus also comes out. Uh, in January. Yeah, I have a lot to look forward to. Yeah, there's a lot of games I look for. Um, I'm looking forward to. So, yeah, rest in peace, my money. 
but yeah, honestly, yeah, but I had fun again. I had fun opening. I always have fun opening these packs. I hope you guys had fun watching um me open these packs. Um, I had a great time as always. We pulled some amazing cards again, as I said earlier. This Chilling Rain box was definitely better. Aside from not pulling a gold card, <clears throat> I would say, I would still say this, this box was way better than the Battle Stars box we did. So, yeah, this was amazing. This was a fun time, and I hope you guys enjoyed as well. Um, again, I guess my next, I would say my next uh, Pokemon card opening will be in august late august when evolving skies releases so i know and i know evolving skies will be really sought after i know yeah yeah i know evolving skies is going to be really sought after so I'm, i know for sure i'm going to have to pre-order um a box it will be easy to get so don't worry hopefully but I know for sure it's going to be like, I know a lot of people will want to get their hands on Evolving Skies because of the EV evolutions in the set. I know a lot of people will, uh, freaking bought out the EV Hero set in Japan. Hell, I, even I kind of wanted, I, I wanted to get my hands on the EV Hero set and do an opening. But it's fine. But yeah, I do look forward to the Evolving Skies uh, set that comes out in August. I don't know what else comes out in that or releases in that set aside from EV, the Evolutions, and I believe Rayquaza because they did show Rayquaza on um, when they announced um, the Evolving Skies set. Jap uh, Japanese will reprint, so wait for sensible pricing. Yeah, yeah, of course. But yeah. I think that's the plan. One box for each new release. So if I'm not, if I, yeah, if I don't do another, I don't know, Battle Styles or Chilling Rain opening in between the time of release, between now and the time of uh, Evolving Skies release, then yeah, more than likely my next opening will be for Evolving Skies in late August. So I think that's the plan. And yeah, so from here on until late August will be games, games, new games, games. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of games to look forward to for me. So yeah, sounds good. You have plenty of games to stream until then. Yeah, yeah, of course. So yeah, again, everyone, thank you all for coming by and hanging out and watching while I, you know, open these packs and. I guess experiencing the amazing polls with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys, I don't know, um, were as surprised and shocked as I was when I, when we pulled these uh these amazing cards. Um, and yeah, I guess yeah. The next next opening will be in August, but I'll be back tomorrow. With uh, I'll be back tomorrow. And we'll be continuing more uh, near replicant. So hope to see you guys then. But yeah, until then, everyone, thank you again for coming by. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend, the rest of your night or day, depending on what time it is for you. And um, yeah, I'll see everyone tomorrow. Bye.